Hello everyone. Today we'll be installing WordPress on our HostMonster account. We'll begin with the welcome email. And as it does not contain a direct link to the control panel, we'll use the small HostMonster link down at the bottom. We'll press the button for the control panel login. We'll log in. And here we can see the cPanel control panel. Under the website section, we'll click on the icon for WordPress. The Mojo Marketplace installer is loading. And here we have the Mojo Marketplace WordPress installation screen. We'll click on install a brand new instance. The first thing we'll need to do is select the domain on which to install WordPress. There is a drop down menu with three options. As we prefer the W version, we're going to leave this field as is. The next thing we need to do is decide on a directory in which to install WordPress. As WordPress will be the content management system for our entire website, we would like to install it in the root directory and therefore we'll leave this form field as is. Even though it says directory, WordPress will not install into a directory named directory. It will install into the root. Next, we'll click the Check Domain button. We'll click on Show Advanced Options. And here, we can choose a name for our website. This can always be changed later using the WordPress dashboard, so you don't have to get it right the first time. We'll call our site NCM test site. Admin username. The default email address is fine. Admin password. The default is fine. We'll copy it so that we can log into the WordPress dashboard. Next, we'll agree to the terms and conditions. And we'll click on the Install Now button. We'll get rid of the ad. And here we can see the WordPress installation progress bar. We'll just wait patiently while the installation completes. The message tells us that the installation is complete. We'll click on View Credentials. And next, we'll click on the Admin URL in order to log into the WordPress dashboard. We'll paste our password and log in. And here you can see our brand new WordPress dashboard. From this screen, we can control all of the WordPress functions. We can create a new post simply by clicking on plus new post, adding a title for our post, adding content, and clicking publish. But we're not going to create a new post. We're just going to take a look at our new WordPress site. This is the Hello World post. It can be deleted using the WordPress dashboard. We can also change the look of our site by changing the theme from the WordPress dashboard. You notice here 
that although we named our site NCM test site, it instead has the wrong name of my great WordPress blog. This is a common error when using Mojo Marketplace for installations. We don't know why it happens. We can tell you that you can also change the site name using the WordPress dashboard and you can also change the site tagline the same way. But as we can see, WordPress has been successfully installed. I want to thank you for watching this video and invite you to visit NCM online for web hosting reviews, coupon codes, and more.